National Preparedness Month, and this week is all about us, the youth. It might seem like it's impossible to get ready for a disaster like a hurricane or an earthquake, but really, it's all about preparing ahead of time. The key is to talk to your family and friends about preparedness and what plans you guys have in place in case of an emergency. Does every family member have their go bag packed? Where are we meeting up in case we're separated during a disaster? Have we stocked up on an extra bottle of water? Do I have portable chargers for my devices in case the power goes out because I know I'm going to want to stream my shows? These are all examples of important unnecessary questions that need to be asked so that you can know what to do in the event disaster strikes. Believe it or not, sometimes our parents can slack off when it comes to preparing for emergencies. They're working, paying bills, or doing other parenting things. They need the extra nudge from us to remind them how crucial preparation is when it comes to these events. So the next time you and your parents are at the grocery store, remind them to pick up some extra canned goods, some medical supplies to make an emergency first aid kit. On the weekends, practice your family evacuation plan with them so that everyone in your family has it down. And it doesn't have to end there. You can get your friends and your school involved by telling them to set up their own emergency plans. Be the push your community needs to be prepared. It starts with us. Itima has made it super simple for us to get all the info we need on preparedness. They have all the major social media platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, even TikTok. They're always posting information on their platforms about weather updates, preparedness tips, emergencies in the territory to make it even easier to stay connected to one another. You gotta check them out online at www.vitimabi.gov. My team reminds you to be prepared, stay informed, and be vigilant.